Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you some Afro-Caribbean hair shops in Copenhagen. And um, a few weeks ago, I went around and I asked them how much they charge to do braids or twists or to relax hair and everything that you would need to know to get your hair done here. Um, and the reason I made this video is because when I first moved here, I was trying to find somewhere to do my hair, if there even was a place available. And I found out that there were quite a few places available through asking people at work or looking on threads on Reddit or basically anywhere, but no one had condensed them so they were easier to find. So that's why I made this video in case it might be helpful to someone else to know where they all are and what kind of prices or amount that they charge to do hairstyles that you want to do. So I have put all their information in the description box below and their websites and any social media accounts that they might have. I hope you enjoy this video and I'll see you next time. Bye. Winter African Touch has expression for 50 kroner and relaxer as well. It's not a salon, but it's somewhere you can definitely go to look to buy extensions for braids or twists. I didn't see any hair for weaves or anything like that, just expression and some relaxers and hair products, but it's a really small shop, but they also sell like shoes and they have some Indian saris. So I think it's quite a mix of uh, different kind of things that you can find there even though it's called African Touch they've got quite a few different things from different cultures in there as well so Saloon charges 250 kroner per hour if you want twists or braids and she's used to doing small braids so I showed her mine and she actually asked me if I could teach her how to do my style of um, thicker twists and she'd be happy to learn but she's only used to doing small braids for 250 kroner an hour um, but that's if you bring your own expression or your own hair to use if she has to go and get the hair for you then she charges 350 kroner an hour so I suggest that you go and get your own hair from another store like African Touch where it's 50 kroner for a pack and you might save a few hundred kroner if you're there getting your hair done for a few hours um, and she's there by herself and she's been there for about five years and she's the only hairdresser that's that's in that store now uh, she's super friendly really really nice um, it's a really cool kind of like spot to go like a nice salon um, there were some people in there and a little kid doing her hair so um, and I think her parents were, were there as well so I didn't really want to film inside too much because it's a bit weird and she also had like nice African prints on the walls and she had like black hair magazines you know essence and all those kind of stuff um, she had those big rods that you use to like curl your hair or your weaves um, and some like afro combs so she looks like she has the equipment to handle afro hair um, but yeah it was really really nice set up nice and cozy there was like a tea and coffee station in the corner so if you were to get your hair done there I think you'd feel pretty comfortable. So this next one called African Hairstyles, she charges 1500 kroner for braids and that depends on how long and how thick your natural hair is and also how long and how thick you want the braids to be. So it starts from 1500 kroner and it goes up from there and she doesn't do twists, only braids. She sells expression to use as your extension for braids for about 55 kroner so that would be on top of the 1500 uh, kroner for braids and they had some really really cool colors in there they had like yellow and blue expression so if you want crazy colors you can definitely find some in there I don't mean like blonde yellow I mean like almost neon yellow for 55 kroner which is pretty good for weaves it's 800 kroner if you come with your own hair and that's without cornrows as well so you have to pay extra for cornrows and bring your own hair for you to pay 800 kroner so the hair that you could buy to do weaves they do have those in the store but they would just hang in the store uh, I've never seen that kind of setup before where almost none of the hair was in any packaging. It was just hanging off the walls. But of course, you can also order some online from, you know, AliExpress and then go to the store to get it fixed. Um, and the price of the cornrows depends on the style that you want to do. So if you want to have leave out or no leave out and things like that. They have relaxer and they relax hair for about 400 kroner. So that's pretty good and there are three of them that work there so if you want to get your hair done and you want to do a hairstyle that might take a while you at least know that three of them are able to come in and help you do it as well um, it's a really nice shop it looks really cozy they sell some sleek makeup but there's like a lot of things to choose from and the lady herself seems very very friendly she's really nice it was so warm inside <laughs> inside the salon as well 
So AfroShop charges 300 kroner to relax your hair and to buy relaxer it's 70 kroner. The hair for weaves can start between 60 to 80 kroner depending on the type of weave that you want. They're not in packets again, they're just out on the racks. And to attach weaves it's about 800 kroner including the cornrows this time. Um, she does sell wigs as well. They, ha they I think they've been wigs in all the stores I've been to so far. Um, she doesn't do twists like mine but she does braids starting from 600 kroner. It's a really nice store, it's quite big. There's lots of space in the back with hair and some more products. There are a few customers in there. There was one Danish lady getting blonde extensions weaved into her hair and her friend was there as well. This whole street that I've been on has a few shops and salons so it's definitely a good area to find Afro hair and salon products. So this store, they only spoke Danish unfortunately. They didn't have any English speaking staff so I couldn't really ask how much the products were and we were all just kind of getting a bit confused. Um, but it looks like a good store to go to and get products from and they have a lot of products and they also have a bathroom as well which is good to know if you're going to be doing you know braids or twists or a hairstyle that takes a while and you know that you'll be there for a while um they had two members of staff in there and there and two customers they don't know how much their stuff was but they did have relaxer and kind of normal products, uh, Afro hair products. So if you do want to go and get your hair relaxed, that might be a good place to go. Um, if you can also speak Danish, that would be good just for ease to understand each other a bit better. So Sweetie's Hair Studio, Brazilian hair is about 2,000 kroner, yeesh. And, uh, you know, short, black, not Brazilian, kind of less quality weave is 900 kroner. And to do weaves, it's about 600, including cornrows. She doesn't do twists, but braids are about 800 kroner if you have your own hair. Um, she doesn't do relaxing anymore because she needs to keep an eye on the rest of the store and it's just this lady working there. But she's a lovely, lovely woman. She's so friendly. She was eating her lunch, which was like potatoes, obviously, and some like sauce and she stopped when I came in and was showing me around and I told her I was Nigerian and she was really really happy about that it was just really really nice and the prices are okay I can't vouch for the quality of their work um, but this area is full of places to do your hair I probably won't get my hair done in Copenhagen just because I feel so comfortable with my hairdresser in London and I go back relatively often so I can just get my hair done if I am back in London but she's a really really lovely woman she's just one person in the store so if you're in the area and you want to check out some products she's got loads of products in there some bonding glue I saw and just like lots of random things like a typical it reminds me of like a London uh, Upton Park kind of store where there's just a range of like <laughs> stuff um, but it's good if you're looking for something and you can't find it anywhere I feel like she would be one to have it in there but yeah so this is actually another branch of the afro shop that I went to earlier so the prices are the same I asked her about Brazilian hair this time and that is about about 1500 kroner and less quality hair you know down from Brazilian would be about 600 kroner upwards to weave the hair is 600 kroner as well she doesn't do twists but she does do braids for about 800 kroner expression is again 50 kroner so in other shops it's been about 50 or 55 kroner so similar prices everywhere that I've been today it was really warm in there <laughs> and uh, there are lots of them that work there but there's only one of them in there at the moment I think it's quite similar to the other place I went to where people get called in if they have a lot of appointments or bookings or like a big task to do and she she speaks Danish and English. She was speaking English to uh, a customer who walked in looking for blonde hair extensions with clips. Um, so she does that kind of range of stuff as well. Um, all the salons I've been to today have that range of extensions with clips if, you're, if that's what you're looking for. So this store, Scaly, um, I was basically walking from a different shop to go to another hairdresser's and I saw a little girl in the window getting her box braids done. So I just went inside to have a look around and speak to the hairdresser. So I didn't get any footage of the salon, unfortunately, but they didn't have many products in there. I don't think they do any relaxing, but the girl's braids looked fire. So they charge 15,000 kroner upwards for braids and twists, uh, depending on the length of your hair and the length of the braids that you want and how thick your natural hair is. So I asked what they might charge for my hair, for hair that's my length and my size for twists and they were saying that they need to see how big my natural hair is. So um, it's quite expensive. It's almost £170 just to start braiding your hair but it looked very, very tidy and very professional. They were also super friendly, really, really nice. It's really cosy. The only thing that would put me off is that the seat 
for doing your hair, like the seat that you were sitting is right next to the window. So that's how I saw the girl getting her braids done. Um, so I don't really know if I'd want to be sat there myself, you know, looking hickey hagger with my hair just all over the place where everyone can walk past and see me. Um, but also who really cares? <laughs> At this last uh, hair salon, they don't sell any products. You have to go and get them yourself from somewhere else. But she, uh, the lady in there directed me to uh, the area that I've just come from. So you can definitely jump in one of those other stores um, and just grab some products and maybe go there and get your hair done. Um, to twist your hair like mine, to do everything, is 2,000 kroner. So it's a bit pricier than every other place that I've been to today. But she was also doing braids on this um, little girl again. And there were quite uh, thin braids this time but they looked really really good um all the prices that she charges were at the front of the store so I didn't really feel the need to ask too much um because they're on the door the seats are by the window again but they've got writing over the window this time so it doesn't really matter if you're sat right next to the window doing your hair and to relax your hair it starts from 700 kroner depending on your texture and things like that um, and as for the customers, there were two ladies in there with their children and then there were also some other children. I think they might have been the kids of the people working in the store. There were about four, two men, two ladies working in the store. So it just had like a real kind of family vibe, like really, really nice and homely. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more videos. See you next time. Bye. Babe, go away. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna do it. I don't even care if you're listening, but don't listen. Yeah, I wasn't listening, but then I heard you yell, the high guys really loud. It's in the description boxes below. No. <laughs> oh, this is taking me ages. Okay. That's a good one. Okay, now what's to do at the end? Um hi guys. <laughs> oh, good idea.